feel down But I hit the ground running Makes me feel alive I was searching for the answers Until I changed the question I pulled back the curtain The ground running makes me feel alive I see what my passion emits and press past the limits Welcome to Chikara Podcast of Gogo. I am Wiggly, Lightning Mike Quackenbush. You might have seen us on the internet. Hey, Mike, today we begin coverage of Anniversario Yang. True. And th these two matches that are going to be featured are also featured on the Chikara Sampler Disc. True. Which was only available for a limited time. But guess what? What? I saw it online. True. And you it was can legit. Check it out. That's right. Not bogus. Legit. You can check it out at hybridentertainment.tv. You can stream Chikara events right onto your computer, and one of the titles available for streaming is that Chikara Sampler. Five awesome matches from 2009. And of course, what we have for you right now is a clip from one of those self-same matches. It's Relevos Atomicos time! Eight-man tag. Hollow Wicked, Frightmare, Hollow Wicked Sito, Frightmare Sito. On the flip side, you'll see yours truly teaming with Jigsaw, Lince Dorado, and Helios, if I'm not mistaken. The wrestling occurs now. Coming in here, we've got Hill, Hollow Wicked and Frightmare, along with Hollow Wicked and Frightmare, otherwise known as Chichen Cloudy. What's the meaning of that? Can they do that? Well, Ultramantis, some call it mind games. You might be familiar with it. Mm. Hollow Wicked on the outside now. Quack takes a shot. Yeah. Missing. Hollow Wicked coming back in. And nice fireman's carry take down by Hollow Wicked. A little Chisha student action here. Quack, watch those shoulders. Comes up, down. What an incredible yeah. reversal by Mike Quack. He's got a thousand of them. Arm drag down goes Hollow Wicked and Quackabush back up to his feet. Single leg take down by Quackabush hits the ropes. Over top Hollow Wicked. Leap run by Hollow Wicked. Look out by Quackabush dives over. Into the ropes goes Quack. Lightning fast excitement. And out of the ring goes Hollow Wicked. In comes Frightmare. Lucha Libre rules. That prompts the tag. And Quack dumping Hollow Wicked in his corner. Very, very sound tech, sound strategy. Missing with a clothesline. Hollow Wicked number two, otherwise known as the New Wave Chi Hernandez. Beautiful arm drag. I, I'm pretty sure it's Chi Hernandez. I'm, I'm judging by uh, the height difference. One never knows. You can't know for sure. Beautiful reverse crate. Oh no, Jigsaw stopped at midway. But another one. Nice series of pinning combinations, but uh, no one's successful. Double leg takedown. Jigsaw hooks him up. Nice reversal. Another two count. Fast paced action. This is incredible. Four on four. Atomicos. It's chaotic. It's one of Chikara's specialties. Hot and heavy back and forth. Oh my. Now, how, how, excuse me. Hello, looking number two in the corner. They're all trading shots. Echoing throughout the arena of South Philadelphia, the world famous arena where everyone wants to make a name for themselves. Right now, Cheech going up top. On the top rope with a drop kick and a beautiful takeover. Jigsaw goes out of the ring. Lindsay Dorado with a drop kick. Here comes Frightmare. The lightning quick Frightmare. The high strung protege of Hello Wicked. Going up with a step up. The step up Frankensteiner. Beautifully done. Trying to get to the world backbreaker, but, but Frightmare is just so hard to hold. Such speed and agility. As the Black Rose would say, he is just hard to handle that one. Beautiful back leg trip by Lindsay Dorado trying to ground the youngster. Of course, Lindsay Dorado, no stranger to high risk maneuvers himself. Another beautiful, beautiful Hurricane Rana. Pops him up. Lindsay Dorado goes over to that second turnbook all the way to the top with a boots on down. Oh! 
punctuated it with a drag off that press. Frankman now propping Lince up on that top rope. But Lince wisely getting down from that position in a hurry. What a clothesline. A flying clothesline by Frightmare. Frightmare now going to the rope. At three to floor. Look oh. out. Look out. The Comet comes crashing down. This Frightmare is absolutely... He's frantic. He's, he's all over the place. Chikara fans, drop by our online store. That's where you can find great deals on stuff like official Chikara t-shirts, replica masks, comic books. You can renew your Chikarmi fan club membership. And now, advanced tickets for season nine await you there. There's a store for U.S. customers and another for you international types. Wow, only two stores to choose from. That's a bargain. Hey, and speaking of bargains, let's go back to Anniversario Yang. Back to Eddie Kingston versus Claudio Castagnoli. What a bargain. Clip it away. King now bringing Claudio up, just what? neither of them able to stand almost without the ropes in the corner. That's what they're taking out of each other. Oh, headbutt by King. Right between took, the eyes, it looked like. Took some out of him. Slouched over. Whips Claudio. King with the big Yakuza. Absolutely hard to argue with the best Yakuza in the game. Claudio with the bicycle! He could all that one matches, but he's got to cover him! He has to cover him! It came out of nowhere, but again, both men sped. Absolutely! Claudio! We, we may never have a decisive winner here. We may run out of time. Out of time, and who knows? I don't think either oh. man wants to give up. They will go down fighting to the very last match. Absolutely, what a match, though! What a wrestling match, Claudio now. I think just realized where King was. Looking at the ropes, looking at the fans. Now he set his eyes on his opponent. Both of them slowly. But you can see the way they're looking through. They want more. Oh, nobody wants a time win. Nobody wants any kind of a draw. Whoever it is, we want to see a decisive victory. Claudio with the uppercut. Not, not like he was thrown at the beginning of the match, man. Just, oh man, now look at these two. Playtime over. King with a knee to the gut. This is brutal. Looking for the back fist. Met him with an uppercut. Claudio looking for the old one. Out the bar, water slide. Hooks the leg deep, near leg. Two. What? Unbelievable. Kicks him somehow, somewhere. Now looking for that deadlift German. Spins him around. Bridges with a two. No. Was it going to take that foot? Where is King getting this? Where is King getting this? The prize went so deep after what happened in Wallingford. He lost the other King down to a knee. Trips him down. Hooks him up. Hooks him up. Tight. Hooks. Three. Three. Kicks the big Claudio with a wrestling move. He couldn't beat him with strike. He couldn't beat him with the aerial. Fans, the Claudio Castagnoli you saw in that clip, well, he's very different from the man who showed his true colors at Three-Fisted Tales, in my opinion. And I speak for the whole Chikara roster when I say we're going to be looking for answers and a measure of payback come Sunday, January 31st. That's the start of Season 9 in Philadelphia at the ECW Arena. Hey, and uh, while you're waiting for that to happen, of course, go to smartmarkvideo.com and buy all the DVDs that you see before you hear. And also, go check out wetalkgames.com. Hey, Jason Rohr is on this month's show. That guy, I talk about the bohemian lifestyle, independent game maker, making games that are affecting people on an emotional level. With pixel graphics, you won't want to miss that. And all our other guests at wetalkgames.com. Check it out now, and be back here next week for another Chikara podcast to go, go. So that guy played bass with Edie Brickell? Is that how it worked? He, no, that's Rorarare Rums. New Bohemian. The new, right. Ah, oh, my wrist is killing me. <laughs>